the following video is a recap of my second Deoxys Speedform EX raid, Rolks Community Day, my search for Shiny Poliwag, my search for Shiny Bonsley, and lastly, a search for Shiny Scyther. And welcome to Lewis's Adventures Place Pokemon Go. Me, Lewis Marinucci, as your host. In this video, I do a recap of my second Deoxys Speed Form EX raid, Ralts Community Day, not to mention my search for both Shiny Poliwag and Bonsley during the Yokohama Go Fest and Gifts event, and lastly, a search for Shiny Scyther. Originally, I had shot some footage for my Deoxys Speedform raid along with Ralts Community Day, but unfortunately, I lost the footage from Pokemon Go that I shot for these events, so instead, I'm going to give you some recaps of how I did when I did my second Deoxys Speedform raid, I was able to catch a pretty good near perfect Deoxys speed form. I was invited by my friend Abby to Rittenhouse Square for this raid. And then afterwards, we did a couple of Rayquaza raids. No shiny for me in either of those raids, unfortunately. The total of shiny rolls I caught on Community Day was nine. But as you see here, I have only eight because of the fact I had to trade away one of the extra shiny rolls I had to a friend of mine who missed out on community day because of the fact her and I were lucky friends and she gave me a lucky Charmander that I was able to evolve all the way to a lucky Charizard. Also during Rolts community day I ended up doing a Rayquaza raid as you will see here. As a result of this I was able to unlock an EX raid pass for my third Deoxys Speedform EX Raid, which will be in the next episode. During Rolts Community Day, me and my friends did a couple of Rayquaza raids in hopes of trying to score a shiny Rayquaza. But like the other raids I've done for it so far, no success. But hopefully, maybe before Rayquaza leaves, I will get one eventually. In the meantime, I also leave, leave you with enjoying this Kevin McLeod track. I apologize for butchering his last name during the making of my Harry Potter Wizards Unite video.
for the Yokohama Go Fest event. In addition to shiny Poliwag, we are getting all the hat variations of Pikachu, including Detective Pikachu, which of course I heard will be shiny. Stay tuned, everyone, if I manage to get one of these as a shiny, because during the um, Pokemon Day event, I was able to get a female shiny Flower Crown Pikachu last time. Moments ago, I just caught my first shiny Poliwag during this event. The moment I clicked on it, it became shiny. As you see here, I was able to hatch two shiny Bonsly while deciding to hunt for some shiny Scyther behind the art museum. Moments ago, I hatched a shiny Bonsly, which is part of the gifts event that's going on alongside the Yokohama Go Fest event in Pokemon Go. The first two days of hunting behind the art museum for shiny Scyther was not easy. I was disappointed and it was hard, but I didn't give up. I spent a total of three days behind the art museum looking for shiny Scyther, both male and female. But of course, that Friday and Saturday I was not successful. But of course that Sunday, as you will see here after this clip, I did eventually nab two shiny Scyther during the making of this clip before I close this video out, everyone.
during the ending of this video behind the scenes off camera I was lucky and I caught two shiny scyther they were both female and the second one I caught I evolved her into a shiny scissor I finally did it I finally caught a shiny scyther and I closed this video out with saying thanks for watching everyone you can also follow me on Instagram Twitter and Facebook and remember it's time for adventure